direction. Malik Jefferson, local kid from the Richmond area, wants to come back to his hometown and have a good game today. Stocker to the post, nice baby hook for the first two of the game. Bell phrase. They go down and they get an easy bucket. Stockard again, this time from outside showing his range. So he's got the first four points for VCU. They're above the NEC. They can play with anyone. That'll be something to watch. Nice pass from Stockard to Corey Douglas for the easy two. John Cui from Baltimore. He drives and gets blocked by Corey Douglas. And of course, the freshman. Um, limiting VCU to one shot in every possession. Great pass. In the, oh, it was blocked. But the putback can't go. And now Douglas pulls it away. I thought they were going to get a whistle for a second. A Poku who. Throws it down often, was unable to jam that one home. Good defense by VCU. And there's a real pretty move by Trey Clark to split two defenders. VCU showed some patience here, but they're going to have to pick up the urgency here in a moment. Five on the clock. Easy two and a throw down from Mikhail Brown Jones. All created by the pick and pop between Bones Highland and Brown Jones. Thinking about it offensively. Again, they're defending well. Easy two for Ward. Nice dish from who else? Ace Baldwin, the freshman. And that's why Mike Rhodes says that Ace Baldwin can dominate a basketball game and not even score baskets. He's got a great feel for the game. Utah State. He's also higher up on the scouting report this year uh, <laughs> because of what he did last year. There goes Vince Williams shooting a three. We're just going to talk about his shooting, <laughs> which has improved a ton. And the lefty knocks it down. Toledo, Ohio native, has uh, finally been healthy to really have a good offseason. And it's showing. There goes Douglas and count it. Lefty hook from Corey Douglas. Gets it through Malik Jefferson. Cole Thomas going to try another three. He's feeling it now, and he's got another. And you, uh, you and I have done a lot of games here in the Seagull Center. When VCU starts hitting those transition threes, it can get bad very quick. Sure can. Another turnover. Vince Williams steals it away. Nice pass ahead. Highland for a third straight three, and he's got it. Bones Highland has shot himself into a hot streak. 31-14 PCU on top of 419 to go in this first half. I think it was a quality Memphis team they beat. Yeah. And basketball is a game of inches. Ward, watch out! <laughs> Hassan Ward. The big fella throwing it down. Lockdown's number zero out there. Vince Williams showing off that improving three, and he buries it. As you touched on in the first half, that's James Harden-esque. It is. Seeing the opening, getting all the way to the rim. Been a tough day for him so far. It's one for six, but that was a, a nice one. And there's a big three from Jameer Watkins from Trenton Catholic. Now, Hopewell is in Richmond, but it's right in the back door. They do have a Richmond player on their team. Of course, DeAndre Thomas. Throw ahead and the slam by Brown Jones. Put up an 11 minute mark here in the second half. And stolen away. Here comes Trey Clark with a run out, passing it ahead. There's Watkins in the flush. Jameer Watkins. 